Hello everyone, my name is Argama Witch, and today I'm going to show you how to do hair drills things. I don't know. Alright, so I'm adding a freehand group, and if you're wondering why I sound extra tired today, is because I just did my 13 hour birthday stream, and I'm a little exhausted. Also dehydrated. Anyways, I turn the guide parameters down, uh, the height down, because I find it easier to work it with it like this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the side. I'm just going to, you know, pull it out to where I want these things. Now these are not hair I make often, if ever. In fact, never ever. But I've been getting requests for shit like this, so here we are. I'm just gonna kind of set this where I need. Because I'm gonna have the drills come down over here. So, oops. Let's do straight. Yeah, you know what? That's fine for now. We'll fix it in post. Oh, I don't have my mirror on. Let's add that. Mirror magic. You know what? Let's do a little smaller. Blup. Good enough. How many strands? Perfect. Does it sound like I've given up on life? Because I kind of feel that way. Not that I've given up on life, but just given up on everything. <laughs> this might need to be a little thicker than that, but we can adjust these as well. We'll bring them up to 80, I guess. Boop. Yeah, you know, that's... that's it's good enough. I'm gonna go over to the texture. And this is where things get a little more challenging. Or at least for me. Maybe there's an easier way? I don't know it. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just take this. I'm gonna use the base because I'm lazy, man. I don't care enough right now. <laughs> Need you to understand. I've checked out. And what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna kinda like draw in our spirals type of thing sort of like that but we need it to kind of like line up a little bit and it's a little bit of a challenge or at least i've had challenges with this because you want it to kind of like sp spiral around the thing but it doesn't always uh, work right. Also, I forgot. Hold on, I'm dumb. I have to make that with down small. There we go. Yeah, I need to be able to see what I'm doing. Thanks. All right, good. And what I'm doing is this should line up kind of with this, and you'll see that's not perfect. So when you go over here, you know you'll you'll see that it's not perfect, like right there. So. So that goes up to here, and if I want to like just adjust it a little bit, and this is going to want to come down a little bit. Okay, Gucci. Um, and I'm gonna clean this up real quick. Alright, now I'm just gonna kinda like and color it up a little bit, you know? And I have the alpha lock on so that way I can just kind of like color this without too much of an issue. Although I may make that a bit, a bit I don't know. Uh, 
I'll also leave this texture available for uh, anyone who wants it if they want to just color over it themselves, you know? And normally I do this in like Clip Studio Paint. But I'm kind of going a little quick on this just to show you guys how it's done. And like with all of the stuff I show you here on these tutorials and stuff, it's just how it's done. It's it's not like perfect and like normally I'd probably spend more time on it. Um, but it's just to help you guys out. Also, there might be other people who've done tutorials for this type of hair. I don't really know because honestly, I don't look up V-Roy tutorials. I'm just sort of <clears throat> doing, you know, what people are asking me. And the one hair tutorial I did that had like, um, uh, twin tails, they were asking about, uh, drills. All right, <clears throat> and like, yeah, you can uh, move these around to adjust where you want, like, the swirls to be in case you didn't get it right over there or whatever. But you know. hmm. I guess that's fine for me. And you can even uh, adjust like, like the height of it too. I'm gonna keep it right here because that's what I designed it as. Um, another thing you can add to these, um, to give it a little something something, is if you, uh, well, let's, I guess we're gonna duplicate this layer because I kind of forgot, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a little, uh, a little piece that's gonna go to the head. Alright, and for these, you're just going to make a solid texture like you'd have for the rest of the hair, but we don't have the rest of the hair here. So I'm just going to kind of like... Real quick. Because it doesn't matter to me. <clears throat> uh, and then when you go to bone it, just... Uh, just do one side at a time. Go to bone group. You probably want the fixed point close to the top, but not all the way at the top. Look right about there. And now you got spirally, swirly, whirly, hairy, wearies. There you go, that's how you do this. Uh, it took me a total of 15 minutes to do this whole thing from scratch, and uh, this video is even shorter because I speed up things. But um, again, if you're one of my members on the channel, I will have the texture for this hair available. Um, all right, uh, thank you. If you um, have any questions, leave them in the comments below, uh, or go check the Vroid Discord, or, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, all that, you know, whatever. I'll see you later. Bye.